Outlaw Pass number five. A lot of things have been said about Outlaw Pass number five. So I guess I'm just going to jump on the bandwagon and throw in a few of my own personal thoughts about Outlaw Pass number five. It's aight. You know, it's not the worst thing that's ever happened to Red Dead Online. Yeah, it's not the best. So, you know, like, honestly, you know, when you play this game as much as I do, and I play quite a bit, and I know a lot of people do, um, you just want something new every now and then, something different. <laughs> and, yeah, I guess Outlaw Pass is a little bit different. Outlaw Pass number five. I mean, you get stupid things like this. Yeah, that is exactly what it says it is. It's a fake beard. So, you know, you get shit like that. Uh, oh, by the way, I changed the color of uh, my girl's hair. I just made her blonde because I wanted it to match with this stupid beard a little bit better. So I changed her hair color. Her hair color is typically jet black, but uh, I changed it just so that I could match it up with this stupid fake beard. So the fake beard, when applied, it is basically a bandana and you wear it around your neck like this. And so if you want it to um, go up to your face like a real fake beard, then you got to go to your wardrobe and then in your wardrobe uh, outfit options, you've got to modify it so that it goes up over your face. There it is. <laughs> yeah, that's Outlaw Pass number five in a nutshell. This is the content that uh, that Rockstar is giving us right now. So, you know, all in all, like. Ultimately, I want to say that, you know, it's it's fine, whatever, it's okay. It's not as, you know, shitty or crappy as some people might be suggesting it is. I think it's all right. I mean, I, okay, one thing that I really enjoy about this game is I like, I really like dressing up. Like, seriously, I have tons of clothes. And I kind of like some of the new stuff that they're offering, like in terms of the, the clothing options. Like, for example, you know, you get these gloves. This is like the first thing you get. And you don't even have to buy Outlaw Pass number five to get these. You just have to play the game and get your, um, your club rewards up just enough to get that first uh, reward. But then you get things like these pants. And I think the way you pronounce this is, I think it's... For show? For show? Like, like you know, it's, it's for show, whatever. <laughs> it's stupid, right? But anyways, you get, you get those. You know, the vest is just something I bought at the shops to match it. So you get the pants. You get the boots. You know, these for show boots right here. I put some spurs on that kind of match it because you don't get a set of spurs with those. But you get these these boots here. And if you want to see what they look like, you know, what what the what the whole boot looks like, then you gotta to go to your outfits again. And you have to modify so that your boots are over the pants, and then you get to see them like this as they are. So here they are with uh uh your pants tucked in. I mean, those are kinda of cool, right? I mean it's okay, yeah. But I mean, in terms of like Outlaw Pass 5 goes, it's mostly just like cosmetic upgrades and additions to the game, really. There's like no new story missions. There's no addition to like any of the uh, the roles. Uh, not that I can see or know of right now at this point. If you go to the progress and you check on the club rewards, let's see, I'm already up to rank 48. So, you know, it ranks up pretty quickly, a heck of a lot quicker than your character does. So these are all of the things that I've gotten so far. And, uh, you know, these are all of the down here are all the rewards that you will not get unless you actually buy the Outlaw Pass 5. And you have to spend 35 gold to, to, to open it. And then if you buy the Outlaw Pass within the first, I think, two weeks of its launch, or maybe it's just one week of its launch. You'll get like ten uh, ten golds rebate, like after the first week. And then, as you progress through the Outlaw Pass Five, you will get rewarded some of those golds uh, 
return to your uh, your account. Let me go back to the first. I'll add it up for you. So, so there's the first one. Three gold bars at rank four. And then the next three gold bars comes at rank 15. So that's six. And then the next three gold bars comes at rank... Uh, rank 30. So, so, so far I've gotten back, uh, nine gold bars up to rank 30. And then, um, at rank, where is it? At rank, there it is. Rank 55, you'll get another three gold back. So that would be up to 12 golds returned at rank 55. Uh, let's see, where's the other golds? And then rank 61, you get another three gold. That would be 15 golds returned up to rank 61. And then uh, there's another three gold bar at rank 66, which comes up to, what is that? 18? 18 gold return, rank 66. And then there's 21 golds return. At rank 75. And then at rank 80, which is the last, you will get four gold bars uh, returned. So for a total of 25 gold bars returned, plus the 10 gold rebate, so you will get the entire money refunded upon completing up to rank 80 of the uh, Outlaw Pass number 5. So it's not a bad deal, but you can only get that 10 gold rebate within the first after if you buy the thing within the first week of its launch. And it's already been like uh, four or five days at this point. What is today? Today is the uh, the 19th. And I think it launched on the uh, 16th. So it's been three days. And um, and in three days, I've already gotten 12 gold bars returned plus 10. So 22 gold bars back rebated. This is some of the new stuff. I mean, it's kind of stupid looking, but, you know, you get it for free, essentially. Um, so, you know, I, I think it's not a bad deal. You know, it's it's new free stuff. You know, if you pay up front, open it immediately, you'll get all that money back. But then, you know, you get stuff like, you know, like this, like a, well, one of these rewards is like a mustache for your horse, which is really stupid. Where is it? Let me see if I can find it. There it is. Horse mustache. Horse mustache handlebar. I mean, how dumb is that? I can get that right now. In fact, we should just go to the stable and see what that looks like. Just because. Oh, look, look, look. There it is. You can do the stupid mustache. Okay, so let's get a mustache for the... Oh, my God. Look how dumb that is. So he's got a curled mustache right there. Get a handlebar. Wow, look at that handlebar. Let's see if we can make it look. Are there any good colors on it? Which one's the best one? Is it free? Oh, it is free. How stupid. Which one's the best? I guess for this particular horse. Well, the black one doesn't even look that stand out that good. So let's let's get the white one because it's the most obvious one you can see on its face. So I'm going to claim it. Yay! Horse has a mustache. Stupid. So there I am with all of the new stuff that I got. I got the hat, I got the fake beard, I got the pants, the boots, and the gloves. And that's all I got so far. Later on, uh, as I continue to rank up, I'll be able to get a vest and a jacket. And actually, you get there's two vests and two jacket uh, variants. And then, of course, I think there's like three new belt buckles, which are really stupid and lame, whatever. But it's cool, you know? Like I said, it's all free if you just pay up front and you buy it immediately you'll get all that stuff and um essentially it's free and so <laughs> it's okay it's not that bad like i've been watching youtube channels that are doing reviews on it and they're talking about it and they're saying you know how they feel about it and they're taking polls and shit like that and like a lot of the polls that have been um that have been taken about whether or not you actually like outlaw pass number five something like 65 percent of people polled are saying that they like it and like the other 35 percent of people polled are saying that it's complete garbage so most people generally like it and think it's all right so you know it's all right it's not bad i mean i would not give i would not say it's the best thing ever that 
um, Rockstar has done for RDO. But it's actually kind of cool, you know. You get a little bit of extra content in the game, and it's it's free. The only thing you're really paying into it is your time. <laughs> you know, <laughs> so <laughs> so whatever. So however much time it takes you to get these things is really the only cost to you, uh, aside from buying the game itself. And if you ever actually bought like actual like gold with actual real real world money like I did at one point. <laughs> I bought 55 gold bars for $20 real life. And uh, that was just that was when I first started playing RDO just to get myself started. Let's see what the main looks like. Is there anything special on the main? No, I don't see anything special. Oh, maybe you get these braids. I don't know. I don't see anything. Oh, unkempt and tussled? Is that how you say that? Tussled? I don't know. Anyways, just to check it out and see how it looks. Yeah, it's it's cool. We'll find whatever. You know, it's you know. So here I am with my uh, fake beard and my horse with a mustache and a tussled mane. <laughs> so there you have it. Outlaw pass. Number five, love it or hate it, it's here and it's ready for you to enjoy in all of its full new content glory. Thank you very much. Have a great day.